Hey there! So I just got back from VidCon, bet you haven't heard that one before, and I've gotta say I had a lovely time thanks to you. I gotta say the best part of my experience of this VidCon was meeting you guys and talking to you and taking pictures with people and seeing friends. That, I gotta say, was the highlight of my VidCon this year, so quick little thank you. But aside from that, I figure no better time than now, well, there are probably a lot of better times than now, but this is a good time, I guess. I'm gonna tell you my World Cup story. And if you are into soccer, this might be the video for you, and if you're not into soccer, this still might actually be the video for you. To preface this, um, you might have noticed there's an Argentina scarf behind me right there. And for those of you who don't know, my family is from Argentina. I was born here, but my parents and relatives are all from the south this way, the southern place. So because of that, there's a love for soccer in my family. Well, you know, Argentinian soccer. And here with me living in America, it's not as big as it is in Latin America. And because of that, I have been kind of distant and disconnected from the sport. Not that I don't like it, I love the sport, but I haven't really been following it or being a fan of it in any real way during my life here. But now that the World Cup has started, everyone's been talking about it. And normally I'd follow it, but I wouldn't be so into it. But this year, a lot of people are saying that Argentina really has a chance to win this. And that is where it all began. Um, I started to track the teams, track the games. Every now and then, an article would appear on my phone that had to do with Argentina. Before I knew it, I got sucked into this, and it is bad. So I learned a lot about the game. I learned a lot about how the World Cup works. I learned a lot about players on different teams. And now here I am, being a huge fan of the World Cup. It is July 5th, I guess. It's the 5th of July when this video is going up. And I am going crazy over these soccer games. So I guess if I had to classify myself as something, I guess I would say that I'm a World Cup soccer fan. So if you are into the World Cup, we're kind of towards the end of it now, but who do you think is gonna win? Who are you rooting for? And if you don't care about the World Cup, how has your summer been? So if you like this video, you can give it a thumbs up. And thanks so much for watching. I will see you next week.